Apple's iOS 8 was just announced. So, what new features does it bring, and should you upgrade when it comes out? So right now, Apple's iOS 8 is still in beta. It's actually in beta 1 right now, and I do not have it to demo. But, for to make up for that, I will be showing you iOS 7 and explaining to you the new parts about iOS 8. In iOS 8, there's a lot of things that are going to be new, but for now, I'm just going to cover a few. So first off, let's go into the camera. Now as you see here, we have the normal camera modes here, but will be added will be a time-lapse feature to the left of the slow-mo camera, and that way, we can take time-lapse photos without using a separate app. When iOS 8 comes out, there also will be a nice health app involved too. We'll check stuff like your eating and how much you sleep. A lot of people are raving about how Touch ID is going to be uniquely integrated and also is going to have third-party support. This way, developers can use it for their own apps. Another thing new in iOS 8 would be the option of having your own keyboard. If you don't like Apple's stock keyboard, in iOS 7, you'd have to live with it. But in iOS 8, you can choose a different one. Developers are going to start developing keyboards for iOS 8. Notifications are also going to be greatly upgraded. Now you can reply quicker and like stuff on Facebook without even going into the app. Stuff like this will become quite common when you come to iOS 8. Another thing that's going to be greatly improved in iOS 8 is the Notification Center. Now you'll be able to add your own widgets from third-party apps. Again, third-party notifications will be common in iOS 8. Also, the All and Miss category in notifications will become unified into just notifications, and then you'd have your Today's tab to the left. In iOS 8, the stock mail app will also be pretty improved. Now, you might not be using a third-party mail app. Overall, iOS 8 pretty much seems to be a must update for now. But I will keep you guys posted, and I'll see you next week. Like, comment, subscribe.